Hey guys, my name's Jamin. Thank you for visiting my YouTube channel where I try to bring you a wide variety of computer, do-it-yourself upgrade and repair videos. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to access and replace your battery on a Dell G7 15 Gamer. The exact model is a 7588. If you have any questions, guys, check out the FAQs below in the description first. It could save you some time getting an answer. If you do need to leave me a question, please do so. I try to get to those a couple times a day at least. Okay, so now let's get into the project. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do, make sure your computer's off and unplugged. I'm gonna flip it over, and we're gonna remove this panel to access your battery. Now before going into your computer, notice I have my computer sitting on an anti-static pad. Either a pad or an anti-static bracelet is a really good idea when entering any computer to limit your chances of harming it. If you guys would like any suggestions on tools or supplies that you need for your project, check out the link above. It'll be a link to my Amazon store. On my Amazon store, guys, you're gonna see multiple lists. Repair tools is one of them. This is where you can find commonly used hand tools for repairing computers as well as some anti-static gear to protect them. So I'm gonna take my screwdriver, I'm gonna undo this one single screw right there in the middle, and then you can just pop your panel up like that. It's pretty easy. It comes up fairly easily. There's the inside of your computer, there's your battery. So your battery is held down by a screw there, there, and there and it's plugged into your motherboard there. I'm not sure if yours will be the same way, but my battery cable is labeled battery and motherboard. So it's coming right in there into the motherboard. So I'm gonna go around first and take out these three screws. And then I'll zoom in a little more to show you that plug. So this plug, it's a white plastic plug that attaches to the wires, and that plug goes into a brass port on the motherboard. So instead of pulling on the black wire portion, you can break plugs that way. I'm gonna take a plastic pry tool and I'm gonna go on either side of the white plug and push it out a little at a time until I jimmy the whole thing out. It may be a little slower, but it's safer. There you go, so now it's out. And then your battery just comes right out like that. So there's your battery. Part number is 33YDH, 15.2 volts. I'll have that in the description. If you're thinking about replacing your battery, guys, consider the generic batteries versus the brand name Dell. In my experience, only about 60% of generic batteries actually work. Um, so the Dell batteries, the brand name ones, I know they're a little more pricey, but they may be more reliable. Um, if you don't want to buy brand new from Dell and you need some help finding one, uh, leave me a comment and I can try to help you out. To put this battery back in, we just flip it over, slide it in. You'll see some feet there. They'll slide right into the holes. It lays down. We're going to take this plug, line it up into the same port. Maybe a little tricky. And then once it's in, use your fingernails on the white plug, again, not on the wires, but on the white plug as much as possible, use your fingernails and press it into the port. Like that. And then we can replace those three screws. And there you go. So that's the operation, fairly simple. Again, if you had any questions, check out the FAQs below. It may save you some time getting an answer. I do try to keep those updated all the time. Uh, if you do need to leave me a question, feel free. I try to answer those a couple times a day at least. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.